immigration bill that's already passed the Senate. A group meeting in Irving tonight is lobbying hard to get that bill passed in the House. Phyllis Watson has just returned from that meeting in Irving and is here now to fill us in. Phyllis? Tracy, that lobbying group is called FAIR, the Federation for American Immigration Reform. FAIR's goals are to stop illegal immigration into the United States and update current immigration laws. FAIR emphasized its goals at a meeting in Irving, attended primarily by members of FAIR and supporters of immigration reform. So the, border, the southern border is a, is a total joke, and that's not the, the sole nature of our problem. Fifteen percent of all foreign visitors who come in with foreign visas, we have no record of departure for. That's nine million foreign visitors a year come in. Fifteen percent, we have no record of departure to indicate whether they came or left. Once in the United States, few leave. FAIR believes those immigration problems and more can be corrected with passage of the Simpson-Rodino bill. The major provision of that legislation permits economic penalties against American employers who knowingly hire illegal immigrants. Even if the bill passes, FAIR doesn't plan to stop there, since it believes every domestic problem in our country has been worsened by illegal immigration. FAIR wants to cut the job magnet that attracts illegals to this country close law loopholes that presently allow couples to enter the United States through marriage fraud, cap legal immigration into the United States by setting a limit on how many immigrants may enter annually, control all borders with use of existing technology, and contribute to population control and economic growth in countries where residents flee to the United States for a better life. Dallas Congressman John Bryant, a member of the Congressional Judiciary Committee, agrees something must be done to help Texans. The Americans who need the jobs that are being taken by people that come here from other countries, they are the ones that lose when we leave this, this uh, unfortunate phenomenon unaddressed. And that's why I say that it is not a departure from our history. It's not a departure from our heritage. It's not a change in our policy of openness when the American people say that unbridled, unlimited, illegal immigration across an unprotected border has got to stop. Bryant went on to say that he's not against people fleeing a country for a better life, but he believes Americans give more than anyone else in the world with their lives and their money. Bryant says he's also supporting the Simpson-Rodino bill because it has provisions to safeguard against possible discrimination of American citizens of Hispanic descent. John? Okay, Phil.